Hello, good afternoon, welcome back to my YouTube channel again. This is your host, Santos Miguel Jr., always this morning. Guys, today what I'm going to do is to introduce to you the next uh, routine that I'm going to do in this uh, video tutorial series, okay? Now, guys, again, uh, let me just give you an idea what we have done in the previous tutorials, okay? Now we already finished the log in and the log out. I already show you shown you how I did this. Then the prepaid button and the transfer button. Then I created the history, the log in, log out, and the transfer history. Yeah. Now, guys, uh, today what I'm going to do is to introduce to you another routine here, wherein uh, in a, in an internet cafe we can offer some uh, services. Okay. So I have here a button for available services, okay? So let me share this uh, window so you will see it, okay? So I have here a snack bar. Actually, I have a new Windows form, okay? So when I click this button, uh, then uh, it will show this uh, new window. Then in that window, I have attached or I have created several tab pages or tab control, okay? So I have here a tab control, okay, with several tab pages. Then, uh, okay, for the snack bar, I have here some uh, some snacks or uh, commodities wherein we can offer to computer users like soft drinks, coffee, tea, cookies, case, cake sliced, brownies, potato chips and other chips, okay, biscuit, nuts, candies, okay. Then, uh, as I said, I'm not going to show you the coding today on this part or in this scope. Uh, I'm just going to introduce to you these other services available, okay. Then I have also consumables, tab page, okay. So I have a, several buttons here, okay, wherein you will try to, uh, what do you call this, charge to a station where it is being offered okay so i have a usb ball pen and other uh, consumables okay then please don't forget to charge the station other services i have here printing typing job computer repair programming and other because as i said before i have a small internet cafe i offer these services that's why i'm always showing this one okay? now station details you have seen this already the station detail will show the use of the computers, then the other services are paid by that station, okay? Then receipt, if you want to give a receipt, just a detail of what is, what services uh, avail. Then the price lookup, I have a price lookup here wherein you can change the price. Of course, we are expecting the prices are changing because of the current trend in, uh, here in Philippines, the current trend in dollars and peso exchange, the price might change from time to time. You know, right? Receipt, station detail, other services, okay, consumables, snack bars. Okay. Now, these are the new tab pages I'm trying to introduce. Okay. So, let me show you how are you going to add a, uh, okay, let me share the Okay, sorry for that one. Let me share this. Okay, so hopefully you are seeing my uh, screen. Okay, just to make sure. Okay, so this is my new window, Windows form. Then this is my tab, okay? So this is my tab, okay? Where is my, why, why, what happened here? So let me, uh, okay. Now, I think I need to stop it, okay? So, this is my tab pages, okay? Now, actually, go to the, okay? Then, the collection, okay? So, this is a tab control. Now, this is the tab page collection editor. So, you can add and remove tab pages. Then, let's say this one, tab zero, tab one, tab two, tab three, tab one, and so on, okay? Tab zero, the snack bar. Then you can change the text property. And again, you need to change also the name because later on I'll be showing you some coding. How we will try to code this, okay? So tab consumables, okay? So this is how you are going to edit the collection for the tab pages, okay? 
Now, uh, again, I will not be. I will not be doing any coding today. So I'm just trying to introduce these tab pages. So I think this is the scope of this tutorial. Okay. So again, thank you very much for joining me. And I do hope if you are new to my channel, you will help me promoting my channel by subscribing. You can like, then you can always click the notification bell if you want to be notified if there is a new upload in my channel. And again, as I said, I'm doing this to help engineers who have a very less computer programming background when they want to join the field of building automation or if they are wishing to become a building management or BMS engineer. So again, thank you. Before I will end, I will say God bless us all. Let's all be safe and bye for now.